have two live reports now, beginning with Margie Smith, who's standing by live in Atlantic City with the latest. Margie? Well, Steve, the worst is just a few hours away. The high tide at 2.10 a.m. is supposed to bring with it serious flooding. The problems right now are the winds. We've had sustained winds about 40 to 50 miles an hour up here, and I can verify those 75 mile an hour gusts Julie was talking about. There were times during the day you literally had to hold on to something to keep from being blown away. But the conditions have been this way all day long as shore towns up and down the coast have been bracing for the worst. Live in the newsroom, a local reaction tonight to the apparent end of the showdown with Saddam. Margie? Well, Steve, just like in Washington, reaction here in Philadelphia, both official and unofficial, is marked by relief, caution, and skepticism. Residents either tried to have a normal day today or just pulled up the covers and stayed in. Now Margie Smith joins us live now from Willow Grove with more on this latest wintry mess. Margie? Well, Steve, clearly those people who decided to just pull up the covers and stay inside are the smart ones. Right now, there is some mixture of sleet, freezing rain, rain. I'm not even sure what it is, but I can tell you that it's very messy and it's really, really cold. We're out along Route 611 in Willow Grove. There aren't too many problems out here, probably because there isn't too much traffic out here, and those cars that have ventured out tonight are taking it easy. For the past 24 hours, there's been just one way to travel carefully. 